Lord of an hour is, and we shall praise your name. Christ the Lord is risen again, Christ hath broken every chain. Hark the angels shout for joy, singing evermore on high. Alleluia. He who gave for us his life, who for us endured the strife, is our paschal lamb today. We to sing for joy and say, Alleluia. He who bore all pain and loss, comfort bless upon the cross, lives in glory now on high, pleads for us and hears our cry. Alleluia. Now he bids us tell abroad how the lost may be restored, how the penitent forgiven, how we too may enter heaven. Alleluia. Remember me, Lord God, when you come into your kingdom. Hallelujah. Have mercy, me, God, in your kindness. In your compassion, blot out my offense. Oh, wash me more and more from my guilt. And cleanse me from my sin. My offenses, truly I know them. My sin is always before me. Against you, you alone have I sinned. What is evil in your sight I have done, that you may be justified when you give sentence, and be without reproach when you judge. O oh, see, in guilt I was born, as sin was I conceived. Indeed, you love truth in the heart. Then in the secret of my heart, teach me wisdom. O oh, purify me, then I shall be clean. O oh, wash me, I shall be whiter than snow. Make me hear rejoicing and gladness, that the bones you have crushed may revive. From my sins turn away your face And blot out all my guilt A pure heart create for me, O God Put a steadfast spirit within me Do not cast me away from your presence Nor deprive me of your Holy Spirit Give me again the joy of your help. With a spirit of fervor sustain me, that I may teach transgressors your ways, and sinners may return to you. O oh, rescue me, God, my helper, and my tongue shall ring at your goodness. O Lord, open my lips, and my mouth shall declare your praise. For in sacrifice you take no delight, burnt offering from me you would refuse. My sacrifice a contrite spirit, a humble contrite heart you will not spurn. In your goodness show favour to Zion. Rebuild the walls of Jerusalem. Then you'll be pleased with all the sacrifice. Holocaust offered on your altar. Give praise to the Father Almighty. 
So we send Jesus Christ the Lord to the Spirit who dwells in our hands, both now and forever. Amen. Remember me, Lord God, when you come into your kingdom. Hallelujah. Truly God of Israel, the Saviour, you are the God who lies hidden. Hallelujah. Truly God of Israel, the Saviour, you are the God who lies hidden. They will be put to shame and disgrace to all who resist you. They will take themselves off in dismay, the makers of idols. But Israel is saved by the Lord, saved forevermore. You will never be ashamed or disgraced through endless ages. For this is the word of the Lord, the creator of heaven, the God who made earth and shaped it, he who made it firm. He did not create it in vain, he made it to be lived in. I am the Lord, there is no other. I have not spoken in secret in some dark place. I have not said to Jacob's sons, search for me in vain. I am the Lord, I speak the truth. I proclaim what is right. Assemble all of you, draw near, you who have escaped from the nations. They know nothing who carry around their idols made of wood and keep on praying to a God that cannot save them. State your case and bring your proofs. Consult among yourselves, who proclaimed this beforehand, who foretold it long ago. Was it not I, the Lord? There is no God but me, a God of justice, a saviour. There is none but me. Turn to me and be saved, all the ends of the earth, for I am God, there is no other. By myself I swear it. It is truth that goes forth from my mouth, a word beyond recall. To me every knee shall bow, every tongue shall swear. They will say, In the Lord alone are victory and power, and to, who, and to him will come in dismay all who have resisted. Through the Lord will come victory and glory for all Israel's sons. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, as now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Truly God of Israel, the Saviour, you are a God who lies hidden. Alleluia. Serve the Lord with joy. Alleluia. Cried with joy to the Lord of the earth. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come before him, sing for joy. Know that he, the Lord, is God. He made as we belong to him. We are his people, the sheep of his flock. Go within his gates, giving thanks. Enter his court, songs of praise. Give thanks to him and bless his name. Indeed, how good is the Lord, eternal is merciful love, is faith from age to age. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to his Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. Serve the Lord with joy. Alleluia. The God of our fathers raised Jesus from death after you had killed him by nailing him to a cross. And God raised him to his right side as leader and saviour to give to the people of Israel the opportunity to repent and have their sins forgiven. We are witnesses of these things, we and the Holy Spirit, who is God's gift to those who obey him. The Lord has risen from the dead, Alleluia, Alleluia. The Lord has risen from the dead, Alleluia, Alleluia. For our sake he died on the cross, Alleluia. Alleluia. The Lord has risen from the dead, Alleluia. 
Alleluia. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord has risen from the dead. Alleluia. Alleluia. This is my commandment. Love one another as I have loved you. Alleluia. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has visited his people and redeemed them. He has raised up for us a mighty Saviour in the house of David his servant, as he promised by the lips of holy men. Those were his prophets from of old, a Saviour who would freeze from our foes from the hands of all who hate us. So his love for our fathers is fulfilled, and his holy covenant remembered. He swore to Abraham our father to grant us a tree from fear, and save from the hands of our foes we might serve him in holiness and justice all the days of our life in his presence. As for you, little child, you shall be called a prophet of God the Most High. You shall go ahead of the Lord to prepare his ways before him to make known to his people their salvation through forgiveness of all their sins, the loving kindness of the heart of our God, who visits us like the dawn from on high. He will give light to those in darkness, those who dwell in the shadow of death, and guide us into the way of peace. Give praise to the Father Almighty, to His Son, Jesus Christ the Lord, to the Spirit who dwells in our hearts, both now and forever. Amen. This is my commandment. Love one another as I have loved you. Alleluia. Let us pray to God the Father, who has given us new life through the resurrection of Christ. Make us radiant with Christ's glory. Almighty God, creator of the world, you revealed the old covenant by your mighty deeds and were faithful to men down through the ages. Loving Father, hear the prayer of your children. Make us radiant with Christ's glory. Cleanse our hearts by your truth and guide our lives by your holiness. May we do what is right and pleasing to you. Make us radiant with Christ's glory. Let the light of your face shine upon us. Free us from sin and fill us with your goodness. Make us radiant with Christ's glory. Peace was your son's parting gift to the apostles. Grant your peace to us and to people everywhere. Make us radiant with Christ's glory. At the Saviour's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. 
Lord God, grant that the Easter mystery may shape our lives so that what we celebrate with joy may be our constant defence and salvation. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us and keep us from all evil and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.